Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and today I want to talk about expected release dates for iOS 13 developer beta 5 as well as iOS 13 public beta 4. In this video I also want to talk about one particular feature that I'm hoping Apple brings to the next major beta for iOS 13. Now before we talk about the new feature that I'm hoping Apple will enable and bring to the iOS 13 developer beta 5 and public beta 4, let's talk about expected release dates. Now over the past few weeks this has gotten increasingly more difficult to predict due to an issue with iOS 13 beta 3 and we'll talk about that here in a few seconds. But as you may remember Apple released iOS 13 beta 1 at WWDC on June 3rd. Two weeks later, we saw beta 2 on the 17th. Two weeks and one day later on July 2nd, we saw beta 3. And that's where we had some issues. Apple had to do a re-release on the 8th for iOS 13 developer beta 3. So that kind of threw everything off. Now from July 2nd to July 17th, that is also two weeks and one day. So it looks like two weeks and one day from beta 2 to beta 3 and from beta 3 to beta 4. So if history is any indication and Apple continues on the two weeks plus one day release cycle from the 17th to the 1st, that's when we can expect iOS 13 developer beta 5. Now that's gonna be anywhere from the 29th through the 1st of August. Why is the 25th right there? That is a bug as you see there. There's two number 25s on the week of the 29th and the week of the 22nd. That's kind of weird. Uh, that's a bug definitely. I'm going to report that one. But yeah, we can expect iOS 13 developer beta 5 and public beta 4 on the week of the 29th here coming up shortly. Now keep in mind, once we see the developer beta 5, a day or two later, we'll start seeing the public beta as well. Now let's talk about one particular feature that Apple announced at WWDC coming to iOS 13 that I'm hoping Apple will enable in iOS 13 developer beta 5 and that is audio sharing. Now if you're sitting down watching a movie on your iPhone and iPad and you have two pairs of AirPods, maybe your friend has one and you have one, you can actually share the audio of whatever the content that you're watching on your iPhone or iPad and both devices will have separate controls over the audio sources on their AirPods. So audio sharing is one of those features that I hope Apple brings to iOS 13. I know that a lot of times when I'm watching a movie, I'll just take one AirPod out of my ear and hand it over to a friend or a family member so we can both enjoy the same audio. But this feature will, I'll put a stop to that. This feature will allow you to actually have two sets of AirPods share the same audio source for one particular content and you can both have control over the audio uh, volume of the audio with separate AirPods. So I'm hoping that this feature comes to the iPhone here shortly audio sharing with iOS 13 developer beta 5. Let's wait and see. Again, Apple could be releasing beta 5 anywhere from July 29th to August 1st is when we can expect the next major beta for iOS 13 developer beta 5. I hope you guys enjoy this quick video update. Thank you for watching. Have a great day, guys. I'll see you on the next one. Peace.